everybody welcome back to my channel today i thought we'd be doing something a little bit different and i'm going to be playing through little witch in the woods this game was just released in early access uh, just this week and it's been on my wish list for a while the art style is very cute it looks fun so we'll give it a shot without further ado let's get into it <laughs> doesn't have any voice acting with us, so I will read it out myself. I wonder where the carrot was. You're still thinking about that? Oh, it's the hat that's talking. Okay. We found everything except the carrot. Well, did you look in the kitchen? That's where carrots normally are. I think it's good that we never found the carrot. There was something off about that legendary carrot soup recipe. Okay. I just realised we never checked the men's restroom. Well, that's not the first place you'd look for a carrot, so... Yes, there are just some lines you don't cross. Yeah, exactly. We searched the whole school, save for that place. We never found the carrot. So they, they did check the kitchens, okay, and there were no carrots there. That means the carrot was in the men's restroom. That's uh, disturbing. A carrot in the men's restroom. What an odd sense of humour. <laughs> Someone obviously hasn't taken a food safety course. I should write Jenny a letter asking her to look through the men's restroom. Can't you ask Will instead? It's the men's restroom after all. Nope. If that coward finds it, he'll take it to the teacher bawling, like before. Keep in mind that it, if it weren't for Will, you'd be in jail right now. Or six feet under. Okay. I'm not sure finding a carrot is that important, but... It's a flashback. Flashbacks are supposed to be boring. I see why no one else wants to ride this god-awful train. It's boring enough to drive anyone insane. Hey, a ticket for this train costs 500 pies? Fruit pies? Meat pies? And it's stop at the witch's house in Hylian, where all roads lead to. You are second place at the school for witches. Whatever. I don't care about any of that. How am I second place anyway? I thought she didn't care. I even sneaked into the forbidden room twice. I'm not sure that's a good uh, basis for, you know, achieving good at school. Achieving well at school. Sneaking into forbidden rooms three times. I even looked through the forbidden books in the hidden library in the school basement. I still remember that horned rabbit that was as big as a house. No wonder Will started crying. I would too. I would also start crying. So how did I manage second place? Good question. You obviously did delinquent. I simply didn't want to lose. Cut it out and sit quietly. This is a train only for those who want to su succeed. The witch's house might be dark and damp, but it's only three years of your life. That's a long time. <laughs> fine, fine. Enough for the lecture. As a matter of fact, I'm disturbed with the thought of taking off my shoes when I get off the train. Shoes? For what? I wonder what kind of trouble you'll get into when we arrive. I won't. I won't fall around the moment I get there. I didn't know you had self-awareness. Don't you know about the terrible city of walls it is highly in? First thing to do is to take your shoes off as soon as you get off the train. This is my first time hearing something like that. I heard that Jenny's older sister was wearing strappy boots when she first arrived at Hylian, so she almost couldn't get off because she had to unstrap them completely. See? Mum brought me new shoes as well. Didn't Aria just mean to encourage you? No, Dad also did say that comfortable boots would be better. That's strange. It's true. I'll also ask other people if you don't believe me. Keyword gained. Lace-up boots. It's a pain to wear lace-up boots if you're boarding the train to Hylian. Okay. The truth remains one. Main story. Uh, I'm not sure how much there is to this story. This might be a very quick game. The food was really delicious, though. 
Your face was bright only when you were eating after getting on the train. The omelette that was overflowing with cheese and crab meat ugh, as soon as it was cut. The pink salmon steak seasoned with fresh lemon scented kiwi sauce. Even the slightly frozen strawberries and peach sorbet with whipped cream. Without this meal, I would have jumped off the train sooner. It's def different from the food you buy at the store at the school for witches. I ate that to collect the Great Witch series cards. I got scolded because I was caught keeping the card and throwing away the bread. Don't do that again in Hylian. I'll definitely try the new Bicula curb cakes there. That's if I get to Hylian before I get bored to death. There's a lot of uh, talking in this game, but I'm sure that's fine. Bartender, some kind of cat. Hello, Mr. Bartender. Hey, want a drink? No, I don't drink alcohol. Do you have any tea? Of course. Then I'll have a cup of that. What type of tea? The tea has alcohol, though. Is that okay? Oh, obviously it's not, <laughs> but then that's just alcohol. Alcohol with tea. Potato, potato. Then can I ask you a question instead of a drink? Anytime. Keyword conversations. You can initiate conversations using the keywords at your disposal. Okay. Want some water? Okay. Can I take a look at your shoes? My shoes? What for? From what I've heard, you have to take your shoes off before you step foot into Hylian Station. You work at the train, so you know what I'm talking about, right? Oh, that story. Absolutely. Plenty of confused passengers who were all dressed up for Hylian. If you're wearing shoes of that sort, I'd advise you to untie them in advance. O ye who reacheth Hylian, look first upon thy shoes. Well, that's how the sh saying goes. See, Virgil? I was right, so the hat is named Virgil probably popped up before and I've just completely ignored it, but the preppy boots mum gave me as a present tell me just as much. Those are some nice boots, right? My mum bought them for me when she found out I was graduating Magnum Cum Lord. Sure is amazing you're graduating Magnum Cum Lord despite your antics. You're going to keep up with that attitude of yours? <laughs> Hearing the two of you speak, I have a feeling being boredom won't be an issue. Being boredom. Nope, it's so boring. Aren't you being boredom, Mr. Bartender? I've gotten used to it. But it's certainly gotten less boring, thanks to you and your hat. You've been listening? Other guests would have... Wouldn't, hmm, other guests would have heard about your arson at school for witches by now. I didn't set it on fire. Really? Uh, sure, there was a fire, but that was because I shook a potion five times and made it explode so you did start the fire. Potions must be shaken three times only. Even a non-witch non -witch like me knows that. Exactly. How can you not try shaking it four times having heard that? But you said you shook it five times. Nothing happened on the fourth time so I shook it once more. Yeah, that's, that's fair. An inquisitive mind? You've already got the makings of a fine witch. Thanks for the praise. You would think they would include what happens if you shake it more than three times in the morning to uh, stop people shaking it more than three times, but I don't think he was praising you. <laughs> no, I don't think that was praise either. <laughs> I should be on my way then. Alright, have a fun trip. You can't act like a country bumpkin once you're in the city, got it? You're not going to ask just one person, are you? Why? One is never enough, you know. Even the greatest detectives never reach a conclusion based on a single piece of evidence. Hmm. You have a point. You can view the notes to see the keywords you have. Okay. Just the one. Oh, and it, it says what people you can ask. That's, that's a nice touch. Uh, the controls are a little... Okay. The controls are a little off. Okay. Okay, that's nowhere. Let's keep going. What does Tab do? Okay, that's the quest. Ordinary passenger. Hello. Oh, hello. Am I disturbing you? Negative. 
that sounds like a yes. What's the issue? Oh, I, w I want to ask you about something. You're on the way to Hylian, right? Correct. Um, what's the matter? Oh, it's just that you have a very blunt way of speaking. Oh my, old habits die hard, especially when one is deep in thought. You sound like the janitor from my school. Well, I used to be a soldier. So what brings you here? Speak. Right, let's ask him about the boots. Before that, what? You've been staring at my feet for a while. Is there some kind of problem? Yes, your feet. Your shoes. Oh, I was going to ask anyway. Isn't it uncomfortable to wear such strappy boots? It takes some time to put them on and take them off, but I'm used to it. Then it would be hard for you when you arrive at Hylian. What? What are you talking about? I mean, you have to take your shoes off when you get off. What? 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 Huh? Oh, you were kidding. I'm sorry, I'm rather dull when it comes to things like this. Jenny! Mr. Bartender! The mystery has been solved. Did I make some kind of mistake? No, no. I just realised that I was deceived. Come to think of it, I remember now. It's a joke to make fun of people who visit Hylian for the first time. Stop, you don't have to kill me twice by giving that much detail. I'm sorry. Are you holding back laughter? No, I'm not. He's trying so hard to be considerate of you, don't ask twice. Virgil, I hate you even more now. How did the hat not know about the shoe thing? Wouldn't he have been with Ellie when she heard about the shoes? You don't need to be too upset. When I went there for the first time in the past, I was also tricked by a colleague and took them off. That doesn't comfort me at all, so why was he confused? I feel like a personal experience taking your shoes off, he would immediately know what she was talking about when she mentioned the shoes. But I'm sorry. How do you feel? Why are you asking me that? Your molars might fall out, relax a bit and tell me. I can't believe Jenny deceived me. There's a reason why she's your friend. Now go back to your seat quietly and wait until we've arrived. We still have to... Okay, we still have three more days to go. Three more days? That's a long train ride. That's as terrible as the smell of spotted shiitake mushrooms. Up ahead is the engine room. Okay, can I... I take it I can't go to the engine room. Disappointing. Well, that's probably a good thing. I think Ellie would destroy the engine. Alright now, I have some patience and stay seated. Ugh. Oh, that, that was the whole quest. Okay. Interesting tutorial, but... I'm bored. But you just sat down. This is torture. Stare out the window if you're so bored. Yeah, look outside. Look at that mountain. It must be hiding a cave with strange pillars, statues and a giant door. Sounds like the prologue to a story where you awaken a terrible demon. Wait, hold on. Virgil, shut up and look at the window at the summit of the mountain. There's a gigantic shining tree at the top. A gigantic shining tree. Why is it shining? Does it have luminous flowers? It must be beautiful up close. Give it up. This train won't stop for two days. Good walk back. Uh, I want to get out now. Oh, we are going to destroy the engine, aren't we? I hope we crash. <laughs> That's an awful thing to say. A fat chance of that happening, so just stay bored. After all, you signed up for three years of even more boredom. Aren't there any crocophants? Crocophants? Nearby? Nope. What about boa constrictors? This isn't a jungle. Train robbers? This isn't the Wild West. It's a healing game, remember? It's a healing game, remember? Is it? Hey, a boa constrictor! The correct line is, what's going on? Would a boa constrictor stop a train? There's no station here, why are we stopping? I'm not sure. Maybe there's something wrong with the train. I doubt it's a boa constrictor though. Yeah, I, I doubt it as well. 
I don't care if it's not a boa constrictor. Please just say there's some massively critical issue. Please, please, please. We apologise for the inconvenience. A critical issue, perhaps? The train cannot continue its journey due, due to a critical issue. That's convenient. Yes! Attention, the train will stop until tomorrow morning. And the departure time... Can we go outside? Will likely be announced tomorrow. We will depart immediately if possible. Okay, I'll be back in a bit. In the meantime, please avoid wandering too far from the train. Let's go. I'm not sure if you remember, but... Of course I remember. The shining tree is at the peak. No, not that. We have to get back by tomorrow morning. Well, he, he did literally just say it. I don't think Ellie's memory is that bad. Then we should get going. Okay, new mission. A shining tree. Okay, onwards. It is dark. Wow, it's so dark. If you're scared, we can go back to the train. I love it. Let's hurry. Okay, you can view the memo board to view your current jobs. Okay. Sorry, you can't go beyond here. Why did the train stop? There is something in the train's path. Hmm, maybe it is a boa constrictor. We're working on getting rid of whatever's in the way. Something's in our way? Is it a boa constrictor? A boa constrictor? No, no, it's a strange prickly vine. A strange prickly vine. It's less... Less interesting. Yes, a prickly vine. It wasn't there yesterday, but it seems to have grown overnight. We can't seem to cut it down with a regular axe, but we're doing our best. We've contacted the witches, so I'm sure they'll be here to help in no time. Can I take a look? I happen to be a witch. You're our passenger. It's our responsibility to make sure you're safe. We'll take care of it, so please be patient. Can I just take a peek? I'm sorry. Okay. I love the way the hat glows. That's a nice, that's a nice little addition. Okay, saved. Uh, I'm assuming I only have to follow the glowing path. It's a hill. It's a mountain. It won't be easy to climb. Look over there. There are vines hanging on the hill. I'd, I'd call that more of a cliff than a, a hill. I'll be able to climb that much. That's bad news. It's a secret passageway, Virgil. Is it a secret? I don't think it's a secret or a passageway. Yep, see, I'm, I'm on Virgil's side. I bet there's a path beyond here. It is very dark. All the glowy moss has disappeared. What's this? Looks like little honey pumpkin. Little honey pumpkin. What's that? It's a type of weed that grows in forested areas. The vines grow so fast that you can never get rid of it by hand. You must find the nucleus hidden somewhere to get rid of it. Then I guess we can also get rid of this if we find the nucleus. Or to return to the drain quietly. That can't happen. Let's go look for the nucleus. It must be nearby. Since the nucleus gives off light when you touch the vine, you'll be able to find it. Okay. I'm a little confused about the relationship between Ellie and Virgil. Okay. It is glowing. Uh, there seems to be a lot of uh, difference in what they know. Surely if he is a hat, her hat, he would be... They'd have the same knowledge of these plants. Hm, that's cute. Great, it's time to explore. Please don't use that word. Explore. That word gives me anxiety. No thanks to your mother. Press the sprint button to move faster than normal. Sprinting uses stamina. Okay. Uh, sprinting isn't that much faster than walking normally, to be honest. What's this? Crown apple. Um, 
Can I shake trees? No, okay. The shining tree is at, is at the peak of the mountain, so, so go quickly if you want to see it. You must return to the train by tomorrow morning. Yeah, yeah. It's 10 p.m. It's bags of time. Oh, there's a pot. Can I break it? Okay. Yes. Okay. I cannot. Oh. Which flower? Okay. I cannot interact with the pot. That is slightly disappointing. Uh, glowing flowers? Let's. Can I. Okay, that's pretty but useless. Okay, yeah, are you just gonna keep telling me that? It's 10 pm. It's all good. Oh, more of this stuff. Oh, okay, I can't get that. Yeah, you don't need to keep telling me that, thanks. That, um, that's a helpful map. Okay, the train's down on the left. I'm guessing I need to go back over to the left and up. There's the town, Virgil. But you have to go to Hylian. What a shame. Okay, so it was this way. Uh, I hear something in the bushes. That's not a good sign. Oh, the, the shining tree is at the air. Ooh, what's this? A little acorn? And a well? That I can't do anything with? Okay. Okay, you don't need to keep telling me that. Uh, it was up this way. And... Uh, yeah. It's still 10pm. I think we're still good. Ooh. Sticks. Branch. Is this the stamina? Oh no. Okay. No stamina gauge seems to pop up so far, but... That's no biggie. Okay, you can hold it down. More branches. Can I get branches from all the trees? No, not that one. Yes, okay. I'm pretty sure it was this way, up the mountain. The mountain, yes. You already knew about the mountain. That's a bad thing, right? I always hated mountains. My leather gets worn out from all the wind. The problem with uh, games you collect things, I always want to collect everything. Ooh, ooh, butterfly. Okay, I can't grab those. That's a shame. No. Climb this. Witch flower? Good. A dangle mango? Creative name. A maple herb. And another dangle mamble. Ma mango. Dangle mango. It's <sighs> dangle mango indeed. Uh, what is this way? Okay, I can't do anything with that. Can I? Yes, I can. Go up here. Maple herb? Is that another dangle mangle? Yes. Can I just go up? It's incredibly difficult to see. Um, oh, more rocks. Piece of rock, yes. 
Uh, I'm not sure I'm supposed to be collecting everything, but I can't move that. Okay. Um. Ooh. Why are there so many things blocking the path? It, it is a mountain. This must be a forest with many secrets. All just unkept. What's this? Looks like a barrier made with a witch pattern. Witch pattern? Is there a witch here? There was, or... Do you know how it works? School hammered it into my head. Shouldn't be an issue, as long as it's drawn well. Okay. Investigate. Okay, no explanation, but that's... Can I... jump? No. Or can I do something with this? No. Okay. Mountain summit. Tree? Wow, it's the gigantic shining tree. The same one we saw from the train. This is a bitter grape tea. tea. This is, is a bitter grape tea tree. I don't think the tree is the one that's shining. Check this out, Virgil. There are a ton of butterflies on it. You're right, the butterflies seem to be glowing. These are blue moon butterflies. The butterflies give off a subtle moonlight. The light from these butterflies has the same power as actual moonlight. That's why strange things always happen around these butterflies. Aren't they beautiful? A giant tea tree with butterflies glowing with moonlight. It's not just beautiful, it's an extremely fascinating sight to behold. Isn't this a pretty magnificent discovery? Did you know that those two are rare creatures? What? Those two. The fact that those two are together is amazing. What about those two being together? They're usually raised together artificially to get moonflower in Lucerne Auto. I think I've missed something. It's uncommon for them to be together naturally like this. The tree and the butterflies? Okay. We did find something, right? I guess so. I'll have to write a letter to the school later. Let's look around a bit more. Fill up the codex and all right. Just don't be late. We must return to the train by tomorrow morning. Yes, you have said multiple times. Okay. Let's go back the way we came up. There might be other strange things. You trace your path, okay. Um, the dialogue in this game is a bit uh, awkward. I don't think I'll get a wink of sleep on the train. I wonder if there's anywhere I can sleep for tonight. What about the ground? The dirt and rock should make for a nice bed. That's not funny, Virgil. Well, sleeping on a train might be better. Look, the blue moon butterfly we saw at the peak is here too. You might as well collect some for study purposes. So I can collect the butterflies. You think I could just sneak up and grab it? Wait, do you remember what Mr. Gravier said? Death lives under the bed? No, not that. Draw it before you touch it? That's right. Which is encyclopedia and quill? Press and hold the use quill button to draw. Once, once the gauge is full and the drawing is complete, the subject of the drawing will be recorded in the encyclopedia. Approach it and use the quill to draw it in the encyclopedia. Okay, what were the quill buttons? I've okay. Do, oh, okay, I have to hold it down. Butterfly. A butterfly that emits a soft blue glow from absorbing moonlight. It is sensitive to sound but will not easily go away unless it feels threatened. Habitat and time of appearance. Tools used for collecting. I do not have a hoop. Collectibles that can be acquired. How to make collecting easier. Great. 
Print registered in the catalogue. Let's see. Now, do you see why you can't catch any right now? Uh, at all? Hmm. So you can collect them. You can collect them using a butterfly net. I don't have one right now. Not much you can do now then. But I want to do it right now. Getting to the witch's house in Hylian is more important. Hmm. Let's go back down now. There's got to be something else that's fun. Okay, so I can't collect them at the moment. It's still 10pm. Um, I'm hoping I'm going the same way I came up. What on earth? Little tiny creatures climbing a branch. Oh. Okay, I'm guessing I should be... Which way did I... Oh, was it over here? I think it was over here. Yes, it was. Okay. Oh, it's a cat. Oh, wow. Ellie, let's go back to the train. Look at that, Virgil. A shining white cat. I've never seen anything like that before. Ellie, we have to... Let's go after that creature. I mean, it's already gone. Oh. I, I'm not sure I'd be following something that kept disappearing, but... Draw this. Witch flower. Which is often used as flower in making things, hence the name witch flower. Uh, silver star bell. Buds bloom only at night when there is light. Violet burst from the bud as it flowers can be collected. Okay, with a net. Okay, so I can't collect that yet. I think the cat dropped something and left. What's this? Looks like a witch's chalk. Thing you used to draw things like a pattern. It looks a little different from the one we were using at school. It's just a different packaging. Okay. It's too dark and worn down for me to see anything. I don't see any words, any pictures. Let's come back when it's brighter. I, I mean, I don't think we can. The train leaves in the morning, right? This witch pattern seems to have been erased a bit. It won't work if it gets erased like this. You can draw the pattern again using the same coloured witch chalk. Since I have the one I just picked up earlier, let's draw it again with that. Should I draw the witch pattern again using one which is white chalk? Yes. Alright, I drew the witch pattern again. Following some creepy glowing animal into the forest. Huh? Where did the cat go? Look, Virgil, there's a house. That's a witch's house, isn't it? It looks pretty old. I guess we can talk to the master witch here and stay for a while. Doesn't look like doesn't look like there are people inside. If there's no one, I might stay for a while. Isn't it isn't it natural for an apprentice witch to be at the witch's house? That's true, but it's breaking and entering as well. Anyone there? Is anybody there? Seems like nobody's here. It could be an abandoned witch's house. Because the witch administration can't figure out everything. Alright, let's go inside. It really is an abandoned witch's house. Taking that into consideration, it looks okay. Although it's not that clean. Since the witch's house is managed on her own, doesn't seem to be in a very good condition considering how dirty it is. But the bed looks fine. I guess I can just sleep here. I kind of miss the train. Since the witch's house is a public institution, it's okay to sleep one night or so. And it's better than sleeping outside. Okay. Actions such as collecting or sprinting. Sprinting uses stamina. Okay, so that's the stamina bar. The house
house is a bit messy. We'll just sleep for one day. Who cares? Yeah, we're, we're gonna miss the train. We've been kidnapped by a cat. Um, what's with that face? You slept on a nice fluffy bed. Yes, but I dreamt that I was sleeping on the train. All that effort not to sleep on the train, only to dream of just that. You should have just slept on the train. No, that's not it. I slept very well, actually. I can almost hear the sound of the train. Wait, isn't that actually the sound of the train? What? Really? Is it taking off already? Yeah, it would be. Let's, let's hurry. Okay, then. Okay, well, I think I'm going to leave it on a cliffhanger and end the first episode there. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Uh, please like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe. Bye!